We are now solving problem 10 from the MC-10B from 2019. In a given plane, points A and B are 10 units apart. How many points C are there in the plane such that the perimeter of ABC, triangle ABC is 50 units and the area of triangle ABC is 100 square units? Now let's, let's just draw out a plane. And we have points A and B as a line. This is 10 units. And let's just not draw C first. In order for this triangle to be possible, let's just consider the area. This has got to be 10 times, well, it could be 10 times some x over 2, where this x, well, this is 100, x is equal to 20. That's if we're talking, well, yes, the height has to be 20. I should change that to h. h. So we've established that the base is 10 and then the height is 20. Now there's two primary cases, I guess. Well, let's, let's just count if C is a right triangle like this. C. That's not really good drawing, but it's not to scale. Let's just say that's 20 and this is like a right triangle. So if we... If this is true, then that means this third side must be 100 plus, this, this hypotenuse should be 10 squared plus 20 squared, that's 100 plus 400, or the square root of 500, or 10 root 5 when you take out the, when you take out the 100. Now, we clearly see this is, um, well, we can see, that this is, just by looking at this, the perimeter of triangle ABC is probably not 50 units because there's a radical in the hypotenuse. But even so, this is 10. This is like, so if we add this up, 10 plus 20 is 30, plus 10 root 5. Um, since root 5 is greater than 2, then, and if, then, and if it was root 5, so root 5 is greater than 2. 2 is equal to the square root of 4. So if it was the square root of 4, then that means 10 times 2 plus 30 is 50. So this has to be greater than 50. This does not satisfy that. And since right triangles like this have the maximum area, We've exhausted this possibility as a triangle like this. Now, let, let's see. What if it was a triangle like this? Like an isosceles triangle or something of the sort. Where it's point C up here and this height is 20. Well, if this is an isosceles triangle and this is 5 and 5, then that means this hypotenuse would be 400, 20 squared plus 5 squared, that's 400, plus 25, 425. Again, this does not even seem right, because this is 10 plus 2 times 425, the square root of 425. This is going to be actually over it, because we know that root the square root of 400 is equal to 20. So, this is greater than 2 times 20. If it was 2 times 20, that'd be 50. So, this doesn't work either. So, now we're kind of left with a dilemma. But then again, we can look at the answer choices and see that one of the answer choices is 0. So, there are actually 0 points of C in the plane. That's our answer.